kind of fast. Oh, 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 he's trying to get me. <laughs> what is that on his eyes? He's shedding. I want to get that. Dude. You don't want him to bite you. So. Can you rip Mikey Blue? Let me get that. Can you rip off your finger? Can you rip off your finger, Dad? He can mess you up. I'm just going to peel that off, help him out a little bit. Make him pretty for the video. So, this is the Cuban Knight Anole. And I'm going to read straight from Wikipedia here. It says this is a species of lizard in the Polycrotidae family, and it's the largest species of anole. Other common names include the Cuban Knight Anole. Or just don't let him bite you. Yeah, you can pet him down here. He's really soft. Pet I'm him down scared. here. Down here. Uh, <laughs> I'm scared. Okay, just don't get near his head because that he's strong. Actually, he actually pretty much. Um, a few of these specimens have reached up to 24 inches, although most of them are 13 to 20 inches. This one is probably around, I would say, a foot long, probably 12 inches long. So he's still got some growing yet. Uh, they're actually native to Cuba, so they're invasive here to South Florida. It says they are very territorial and will initially turn face, turn to face almost any perceived threat. During its challenge display, the lizard will sit high on all fours, gape, gaping menacingly, turning green, and bobbing its head. The male will extend its dewlap, which is this right here. So that's a male. And puff himself up with air. And I'm just going to read about his diet and then we're going to let him go. Because you can tell he's getting stressed by his color. Its diet as a young anole consists mainly of insects. As an adult, it eats larger prey such as tarantulas, other anoles, geckos, and even sometimes birds. And that's all straight from Wikipedia. Um, I didn't know a whole lot about these. I just knew that they were indeed in the Anole family. But here he is. Uh, I caught him in West Palm Beach. It was about 45 miles south. And I'm up here in Port St. Lucie in my front yard. We're going to release him. And hopefully we will see him around. I'm going to release him here in these these trees there he is Let's see what he right up the tree <laughs> I'm not catching that thing I have no idea where he went oh there he is he's on that side look at that big lizard look at it look at it there he is He's free.